Well, hello and welcome back. Thanks for coming back. Where are we? Downtown, Keda Paphos, on a truly, truly spectacular day, and we haven't even got out of February. And on top of all of that, I've brought with me the most beautiful woman in the world, Miss Ochin Grisivia Labouf. Hello, everybody. How nice to see you again and again. Shall we go for a little walk along the coastal yes, pathway? Yes, for a little walk. By the and way, see I what's totally going on. Like those, uh, those rock formations, yeah. yes. Do you very, think very nice it's, indeed. Uh, it's easy to go there. Well, what? probably not. Try. But probably not. knowing you, we probably will. So, Let's here go. we go. Let's follow the rear end of Masochin with Siviella Booth, and she's going to take us for a little bit of a walk on some rocks. But before that, we're going to have a little chat with this little Gumbaru, who's saying, hello, you wonderful foreigners. How are you? Have you got anything to eat or not? Beautiful great coat. fur, great coat. There we are. So that's it. Bugger off. I'm going to go and accost those people over there. Oh, he spotted that black spotted one over there. That that's it. A rival for food. Right, Grisivia Le Bouffe. It's a beautiful cat. Have you he is it? a lovely cat. Yes, he is. Very nice fur indeed. Okay. Here we go. We're going to follow the rear end of Misachi and Grisivia Le Bouffe. And we're going to go and do a bit of rock walking, rock climbing in downtown Cato I think. I think she wants to go that way. There we are. Now, please, if you are going to try and go and do some rock climbing in downtown Ketapapos, please, please don't blame us if you fall on your jupper. Don't blame us if you can't get your mouth around certain words like cockamouth. Here we go. Here she goes. She's off. Whoop, the jump of a panther. Now, you may think it's easy for her, which it is, but remember, I've got to follow her with a camera in one hand. Oh, here we go. This one could be interesting. Have a look at that. She's pontificating now. It's going to be the jump of a panther. Oh, this could all end in complete and utter disaster. Hopefully not. Ah. Go on, Grisivia Le Bouffe. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. She's going for the big, big jump indeed. Oh, dear. Oh, now down we go. She's thought better of it. She's understood that that was probably the jump of a panther and that little bit too much. There we go. Clever girl indeed. There we are. Got to where she wants. Now, you, I'm thinking Paul. that I'm going to go onto that rock there. So, as you understand, this could camera. all end in disaster. Give me the there we camera. go. Oh, there we are. Footwork is good. Give there the we camera. are. Let's pass the camera and you can see Mr. Paul as he does the splits. There we go. Oh, a special, special little wiggle for Miss Andrea. And Miss Sarah. Help. If I could turn my jupper, I would. There we are. Help That's it. it. Help, help yourself. There we are. There we are. There we are. Well done, you, Mr. There we are, Paul. Miss <laughs> there we are. And especially for Miss Sarah as well. Help. Now, feast your eyes and digest. Truly, truly spectacular views across the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. Grisivia Le Bouffe is off again. She wants to take us to that rock because she understands that you are going to get. A truly, truly spectacular view across the blue, blue Mediterranean Sea. And of course, she was right. Feast your eyes and digest. Downtown Ketopathos at its very, very best. That's the Ketopathos Harbour in the very distance. As we come back in, that's the promenade. And of course, these are all the hotels along the coastal pathway. And of course, that is the most beautiful woman in the world, Ms. Ochin. You know, when you're observing this uh, very, very, it's like a needle, the surface is not straight, it's like a needle, and it's, you're just standing here, and underneath your feet, you feel like a, a rock needle, uh, tick, 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 ticking you. It's not easy, but uh, yes, it's a really, really nice uh, a view opening from here, especially if you go around. Yes, the spectacular camera. view. Have a look at that. And the salty rocks, little rocks. It's all These salt. are the rocks that are all covered in the salt, of course, and the water evaporates away. Beautiful, beautiful rock formations. There's the monstrosity in the background that they're building, the multi story complex. And of course, just over there is the Amavi Hotel. And just in front of that is the Anesthesia Beach Bar. Spectacular place. And there's one or two people 
in the water, by the way. There's one or two people swimming. Now, whenever I think of the Amavi Hotel, I always think of Joe Cox and his beautiful wife, Miss Julie, their sister, Miss Kath, and, of course, Mr Colin. And, of course, they came out and had a great, great birthday celebrations in that hotel not that long ago. And they're going to do it all over again next December, which, of course, is not that far away. Christina Booth is now transcending her way back. Oop, there we are. Nice rear-end view. Let's go and catch up with her, shall we? So if you want to do some monkeying around in downtown Kedipathos, go hunting through our videos and we will show you pretty much every rock structure that there is. And I remember a gentleman called Paul all the way from Jordan and he brought his beautiful wife called Miss Claire. And uh, he watched us on a video many, many months ago and he said to his wife, hey, let's get on a big bird and let's fly over to Paphos and let's go and walk on some of those rocks. And he actually accosted us on camera if you go and have a look in our back catalogue. What's she up to now? She's kicking something. What are you kicking that for? I don't know, Xavier LeBeau. Could be a little platform for a little pussycat to sit on and sunbathe. Who knows? Probably. Where are we now? Oh, there we are. There's a the cat. That was his sunbathing plateau. And now he's having a bit of a wash. There he is. He's, washing his, uh, he's having a bit of a wash. He's washing his equipment. What did you say? Look at that. What did you just say? Look at that. Yes, he's having a wash. <laughs> he's having a good wash, that's for sure. He says, hey, am I on YouTube? Don't move, Paul. He says, am I on YouTube, is what he says. Let me just wash my tackle. Just had a bit of a Sunday lunch, and now I'm having a bit of a wash. And then I'm going to go and wash my equipment. Now, what did you just say, by the way? He's washing his pinastone. Day man is frantically wiggling the finger. Lady Caroline wants to unsubscribe. He's having a wash. He's a very nice cat, very hygienic. Yes. I think he's drunk, actually. There we are. <laughs> he looks like Where that. are we, by the way? We're, this is Amphora. Amphora, Amphora. Resort. Because there's a few people asked about this resort. Yes, a very, very nice so resort indeed. On. And we know that two superstars, in fact, did stay in here. And those two superstars were the two Jeremy. lords. No, Jeremy. No, Jeremy and Simon. Jeremy and Simon. Yes. They stayed Jeremy here for a week. And they said it was not too bad. That's what they said. And they were here. And it was raining, by the way. And they said it was not too bad. And they said the reception was very, very friendly. And the only thing they queried was the internet. They said the internet was a bit, hmm, Sherlock Holmes. Perhaps even William Shakespeare. You know, these apartments are not very old. They are new and they are made, I think, in the high-tech style, very modern style. Uh, obviously, the furniture and everything should be new. No, I don't think it's so bad. I think it's a very, very nice resort indeed. Now, I know someone's going to come and book in here in the summer, so please get in contact with us and let us come and do a little recon of your room. Let the other viewers see just what it's like. And we understand that that is a dining area. This is a bar area. Normally the sails across the top. Another sail over there. A sail over there. And of course those are sunbathing areas. This will be all covered in sun lounges. And of course everyone will be looking out across the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. And it's a view that is quite simply going to take your breath away a beautiful beautiful resort in a beautiful location and yet it's only 10 minute walk from the downtown Paphos promenade you know in the summertime they take out that sun bed and put around this uh, lovely grass garden uh, surface and then what can be better overlooking the Mediterranean Sea and having the lovely sun base while uh, somewhere here should be the bar, by the way. That's the, the bar area, isn't it? That's the enclosed bar over there. there. And then this yeah. is the open bar area. Yes. It's a bit disorientating because, of course, there's no sails over the top. And again, that's a serving area over there. So a great, great place in a great, great location. Let's go have a quick walk through the ground. The location must be very nice, you know, uh, because you are within uh, 10 to 15 minutes, you... What you can get wherever you want. You can indeed, can't you? In fact, it's only about 25 minutes if you wanted to walk to the old town. I know. Not far at all. So these are the apartments that you are seeing. So obviously there's downstairs apartments, upstairs there, as you can see, and there's even a penthouse effect. Well, if you want, for example, you're a big family and you want to come and rent all these three floors, 
Would, would it be, wouldn't it be nice? Well, I would assume that you can if you booked as a family, isn't it? Okay. They would book all the rooms all side the by friends. side, etc., etc. All, the, et cetera, all the friends, family. exactly. Right. Great location, great grounds, and there's that beautiful bit of garden in the area, which makes it very, very homely indeed. And as I said, you're right on the coastal pathway. To the rear of it, you've got the area known as the Triangle. So there's plenty of places for you to go and eat and to dine and, of course, to get that special drink, a Nigel Big Guns or even perhaps a Dame Anne's Special, which, by the way, if you're curious to know what that is, it's a porn star, anyway. She always has a couple of porn stars, one on each arm of the sofa in the breakfast club, the two Ronnies, if you understand. Come back in the morning and you're gonna to get to watch her chuckle and laugh the day away. Now, right across the road here is its very own little beach. It's not a private beach, but you may as well say it is. Have a look at that. Let's follow the rear end of Crescivia Booth as she transcends and shows you the beauty and the spectacularity of this rather nice sandy beach. It is quite warm, isn't it? Is it? See, we're either complaining it's too cold or it's too hot. <laughs> Let's get down to that beach, walk to the water's edge, and take the breath away of all of our viewers. Here we go. Spectacular day. And we're not even into March, if you understand me. So, if you're looking for that special, special place to come for your holidays, this shame. could be have, the place shame. for you. Well, you could do a bit of a dance. You know, it's when you want to hide, it's Mr. Polo. That's the little the place, there we are. The we we'll lock her in closet. there, that's it, there you go. Miss Crescivi out of Booth has gone. And there she is again, there she is, there we are. That's what she looks like in the morning when she wakes up, by the way. Right, come on, let's get down to the beach and show you the spectacularity. Look how nice. What do you think, Christine? It's actually amazing. When you think that you will go to the lovely weather, it's here. When you think and dream of the lovely blue, blue Mediterranean, Mediterranean Sea, it's here. When you want a quiet, lovely, peaceful atmosphere, it's here. And when you want a lovely, lovely sun and to be sun-based, it's here. So you should come and join us. Yes, come with us to the water's edge. And remember, the sky is blue, the sea is blue, and dressed head to toe in blue. All it's actually missing is... It's you, of course you. So get yourself on a big bird or a canoe and start paddling like a lunatic. Just like us, Mr. Paul and me was... Uh, You've lost your English. Riding the canoe. Canoe. Riding. Now, someone has left their flip-flops. Someone. Someone's out there swimming, obviously. It's not me. And Feast it's your not eyes me. and digest. That's the beauty and the spectacularity of the coastline of Paphos. It doesn't get much better than that. And there's a big bird and launching itself go. up Ooh, into the feet, sky. And I'm trying desperately to keep my feet dry, Miss Andrea, as you can see. Have a look at that. It's trying to come in. But there's that big bird. So if you like what you see, hit the like, click subscribe, and why not come back for a little bit more of our madness. And if you really want to watch the channel grow, why not go through to our about page, hit the buy me a coffee and let us know. And we'll mention you in one of our videos. Thanks for watching. And I would like to tell you many, many thanks for watching. We are loving you to bits. And please, please don't forget to come and see another of our madnesses we loving you and kissing you from the bottom of our two hearts. Thanks for watching. Feast your eyes and digest. It doesn't get much better than that.